Hey guys, so we're back again with the next quest. Uh, I'm just gonna head there now. I'm not sure what it's called exactly, but uh, once we get there, uh, we'll see. If you go up here, I mean, I did come out around here before, so you would normally find some uh, trash mobs around here somewhere. I've got one on me now. I won't worry about him. Right, so if you just go up here, just kill these guys. Up here, and here we are. It's called uh, Redemption. It's going on elite now. So I'm just gonna get some buffs before I move off over here. And also with this hiding as well. I'm gonna keep him here. For now, you enter one of the laboratories where decades ago, house uh, it has been a while since I've done this, but I do have a quite a good idea on what to do. So, you just follow me. I'm pretty sure there's some traps around here somewhere. I mean, if you're a rogue and you have a high enough uh, search, you should be able to uh, disable these traps. And all these traps are pretty easily avoidable. You just got sort of time. If you come out of there, just check the map. Okay. Go through here. Okay, so it's blocked off over here. This is where we go at the end, towards the end of the quest. But for now, we'll just head this way. Kill some more of these. Dead. On the other side of this locked gate, you see a familiar sign. Okay, so we need to open that. Crystals, like the one you saw in Corthos. But what are these ones powering? Should be over here somewhere, the lever. On the valve, there we go. So that door should be open now, and all you have to do here. Is, uh, you have to first activate these crystals so they're targetable and then destroy them and how you do that is you just collect all the valves around here so we turn all of them there's one if you're having trouble targeting any if you just hit backspace 
I'll show you where it is as well and you can click it quite easily. Right, I think we've got one more over here. We've got one more somewhere I think. Oh no. Yeah okay, oh, it's just these big ones over here. There you go. So, if you can see that, that entrance has been opened now. Um, I don't need a shrine, so I'm just gonna go straight there. I will call my hireling now though. So I've just hit that. Go and this is the end. I'm gonna have a fight here. Who in the flame are you? Finish the quest after that. Oh no, the Sawagan found me. So basically, so what we have to do here is uh, protect Lars Hayton. Um, I just have to be careful because um, if they do target him, they can because it's elite. They do do a fair amount of damage. So just try to hit him first, make sure they're attacking you and not him. You see he's still at full health right now. and uh, should be done. Now you see what I have to deal with. Once this Hagen gets your scent, they won't stop until you're dead. I still good on health, so I should finish this. It'll take more than that to put me down, Slahagin. The shield is weakening. We might actually get through this. Just hold for a little longer. Is gone. We, we are done off. here this time. Aiden looks weary after surviving this latest attack. Perhaps if we talk to him talk and again. we finish the quest. Go now. Tell Ursa to hold the barricade just a little longer. Then meet Amalgam at the base of Misery's Peak when you're ready. With hate and fire, there we go. Now. The quest the is done. To hold the grab my loot and we're gonna call. Then meet Amalgam at the base of Misery's Peak when you're ready. Alright, so I'll just recall here and move on to the next quest. I will be in another video. So just look out for that. Leads to an old yeah, don't forget to country. take your end reward. I'm just gonna double a recall here. And you can pick you up from this chick over here. Right, um it doesn't really matter what you get. So stay tuned for my next video. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.